Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of The Streak. We're jumping in again. This time we are going to play as good old um, Piss Baby, I guess. Um, <laughs> this is um, like the alternate version of Blue Baby. Instead of Poop Baby, he's Piss Baby. Kind of an interesting character. I don't know what this item is he starts with here. I'm not quite sure what that is. Uh, but we start with Lemon Mishap, which is pretty good. And the, the cork, so we get the larger spread on it. So, it's it's decent, it's decent. This guy's a, a pretty basic character, but an interesting one and a well sort of thought out and well created one, so I'm interested to see what we can do with him. Unfortunately, the last episode we ended on a crash, the game just kept crashing. I'm hoping we don't get the same today, I think it was related to the character we were playing as. Um, ooh, interesting. Heal one red heart after five uses, chance to do a man Mama Mega explosion, um, and remove the item. Honestly, I think I'm just going to do that in here because we can't take it with us. Like, that actually wasn't bad at all. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> there you go. We got a poop heart out of that. Kind of an interesting idea for a room there. Uh, that item's really good generally. Really, really good. But um, honestly, this character's built around Lemon Mishap. I don't want to throw it away um, straight away on the first floor. Ah. Oh, Stop moving. But yeah, as as anyone that, that listened to the last episode or watched the last episode will know, I'm a little frustrated at the minute. <laughs> I've just come off the back of recording um, yesterday's episode. I'm doing two in a row because I've got to prepare uh, for going away. But a little frustrated that uh, it's not a way that I ever want an episode to end. It's, it actually used to be way more common that that's how episodes would end. Um, it used to happen all the time. But since Repentagon and like a bunch of updates to just Isaac in general, I've been having a lot less crashes. So it's a, it's a shame when they start happening again. Um, and yeah, that was that was quite a few. I have to imagine it was due to the character though. I have to imagine. Right. Don't need to use Lemon Mishap on a room like this. Let's let's have you not not run into corners where I can't shoot you, please. That would be ideal. We do have 10 cents to work with here. Unfortunately, not what we wanted to see. Okay, I think I'll just keep letting this happen for the boss now at this point. But yeah, having this uh, this 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 farty hearty to get dips is really, really nice. The soiled heart, I think they're called. Good. Not a too bad of a room here. Not too bad of a room at all. Okay. I'll save Lemon Mishap for the boss. Boss that flies. Oh wait, no, it still takes damage to it. It's a bit of a waste of it then. Unfortunately, I lost my Soiled Heart there. This version of this boss is is not easy, and it looks like we're about to die. Can, can we can we fucking stop game with the uh, with the spawning of of a lot and a lot and a lot of uh, enemies? Oh man. <sighs> right, people. Okay. Uh, as for the question of the day today, um, what's what's been what's been a cause of your frustration this week? I ask that question a lot. I feel like, but it's always different, so it's a it's a good one to reiterate. This is gross, man. This is absolutely gross. I I am not a fan of this at all. Oh man. There's more of you. Fuck off. How is the more of you? Just die already. <laughs> man, oh man, this was the grossest fight of my life. <laughs> Why was there so many of these things? At least we get a good item off the back of it, but oh god. Not best pleased at all. Not best pleased at all with my performance there. Luckily, our streak is currently basically nowhere, so we don't have to worry about losing the streak again. But I would like to have a good run, because as I said, I'm not in the best of moods right now. How did that set on fire? Okay, it, it literally touched the fire. I see. Bit annoying. Uh, we're probably going to die here, uh, unfortunately, sir. Managed to juke those guys, but for how long, I do not know. Yeah, um, I don't to say, I'm not... Not super hopeful right now. Okay, good. If you could drop me a heart at some point. Kind of wish I'd taken that item that allows us to heal a bunch of times now. That would have been good, wouldn't it? That would have been real good. Okay, come in here and try and get a heart from in here. 
We've at least saved ourselves a bit. Made some of our money back. Ugh. Oh god. I have a I have a build up of, of high amounts of stress going on right now. Because of Isaac, but just in general. But yeah, I, I'm definitely just generally stressing about, like, what to do next with YouTube. Like I said, I don't want to stop Isaac. I still enjoy Isaac, but I definitely need to branch out more for when I do want to stop. Or just sort of, yeah. 50% uh, chance of receiving a fading nickel when a room is cleared. Getting damage caused the player to lose half their money, dropping some of it on the ground. When the player is holding money, damage is always one full heart. That seems very intriguing um and not good but i'm gonna take it because it's funny and i don't think i've ever picked this up before and this run feels somewhat doomed already so i'm i'm, I'm willing to sacrifice but what we can do here is we can we can go and let's just double our money straight up i know it's not the best usage but we can then spawn this and then do that yeah, probably could have used that on a better room, like, in this big room here to get more stuff, but, eh, that's good enough for me right now. Yeah, definitely should have used it in this room, but Lemon Mishap will prevail. Lemon Mishap does a good amount of damage now. You guys do not want to walk into the pest, do you? You don't want to walk into it at all. There's our extra nickel. So, yeah, we are going to have... Buku books here. We are going to have a lot of money. Maybe this item that we've got, this one that we started with, makes it so that uh, flying enemies can still take uh, creep damage. Because that seems potentially likely based on the fact that uh, we were able to hit that enemy as well as the B boss as well. So I'm, I'm, willing to, I'm willing to gamble and say that's what's going on there. All right, item wise. It's not a bad idea to take that. Not a bad idea to take that at all. Gives us an eternal heart, just as is. Probably should have taken it after the boss, to be honest, but... You live and you learn. I do not like the fact that that pot is, uh... Yeah, is is doing things that is going to stop me from being able to get around it. That's... It's real annoying, that is. Real annoying. Okay, good. Just don't get hit by this guy. Okay, the creep's gone now. That makes things easier. Just be careful of the pot's doing their little... Spinny roundy thingy. Could easily get hit by the creep if I'm not careful. Maybe I'm immune to creep, I don't know. I doubt it though. Nice one, we got both of those. Pick that up and see what our card is. Stars is nice for next floor. Yeah, so I did I did also disable the curses, but they're just not disabled. I don't know what happened with that either. That's that's getting on my nerves. Eclipsed is a mod that I quite enjoy, but I'm not. Sort of liking that idea of it. Did get an angel teleport. Unfortunately, really not a very good one at all. Although the prayer card is pretty good. I don't know though. It's pretty good in the sense that, like, it's decent, but I really should be taking Lemon Mishap because it's part of this character's theme. Black hole bombs. Plus one gigabomb. Bombs get a black hole effect, pulls enemies towards and destroys nearby rocks. That seems pretty goddamn good, to be honest. Instantly started causing errors there. Uh, what error was that? Yeah, I have a feeling that um, the Eclipsed is... It, I, I think it's only worked on by one person, and so I think because of that, there's definitely some bugs um, that need to be sorted eventually. But I'm not going to hold it against the developer. Working on a large mod of this scale on your own pretty daunting task and things are easily going to slip through the cracks and there's going to be bugs so no judgment it just it's just one of those things that makes the mod a little harder to enjoy uh fully still enjoying um enjoying what i'm seeing of it but certain things are a little harder to enjoy fully because uh i'm having some bugs here and there bit of a shame but yeah it is what it is it is what it is don't know why i decided to stand in front of that guy that's a bad idea Liking all this money we're getting. It's kind of intriguing. Ooh, weird room. Don't know why there's nothing in there. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Get wrecked, boys. Ooh, we got a smelter penny there. I'll, uh, I'll leave that on the floor in case we find a trinket on this floor. Smelter pennies, obviously. Pretty goddamn rare. Pretty goddamn good. Cool. Let's 
keep moving. Hopefully the shop has something good to offer. Let's just see. Let's test his theory. Okay, yeah. It definitely is killing enemies that are flying. So that's definitely something to do with that item I got. Broken murder. Pretty goddamn good. We'll take that. We'll take that. I've got to destroy that unmarked rock because it could be anything. Could be very, very good. Broken murder doing its thing. I think I'm going to have to use birth bombs for this. Sadly. Ah, oh, are you... You fucking kidding me, game? Lose my eternal heart because of that? That is mighty frustrating. This game's been, been a biatch to me at the moment. It really is. We got Herming. Luckily, they ain't firing right now, so that's fine. Can you stop moving weirdly, please? Thank you. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't get this guy to sit on top of the creep, really, but I can do some damage with it. Unfortunately, I don't have any extra bombs. Broken Murder is helping out on occasion here. This boss isn't exactly easy, though. I just wish Lemon Mishap lasted longer. It's not a bad item, it just doesn't last long enough to be super useful. Aha! We delete your shots and freeze you in place. I really like the rework of this boss, by the way. This this definitely a lot harder, but the, the old version of this boss was absolutely terrible. <laughs> like, design-wise and, like, combat-wise, it was just not fun to fight against, because it just... You threw a bomb at it and just insta-killed it, and you didn't really get to experience any sort of fight. Now it's actually difficult. Boom, boom. Um... The pact probably is a good idea here. But we only get burn hearts. I didn't realize that. That's kind of interesting. We only get burn hearts. But burn hearts are better, so not bad then completely. Right, unfortunately I smelt a penny. Didn't get to see the light of day here. Unless it is a trinket and not just one of those pennies. Oh, it is a trinket. Okay, <laughs> fair enough then. I just got the trinket version. Right, let's go. Let us go into that sweet, sweet night. Alrighty, her. Yeah, I think I think at the minute, you, yeah, we got Kesa Carry in here. All poops are red poops. Um, so it, it's just kind of one of those things where it's like, I'd I'd like to not have those curses, but there seems to be no way to disable them at the moment. The console commands ain't working. Maybe I can go into the actual files and change it, but I don't know. I've, I've messaged the developer either way and, and said that the, the fix didn't seem to work. Um, so we'll, we'll see what happens with that. But yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what the future holds for YouTube and myself and Isaac and stuff. I don't know. Maybe I'll move to doing more streaming, potentially. That could be fun. Just finding the right time. It's easier to, like, schedule videos. Oh, my God. It's easier to, like, schedule when I do videos and stuff, really. Not quite as simple to be able to organize around streaming, because I'd have to do it more on the evenings for, like, more, to, to be better sort of viewership time for most people. But at the same time then, like, it makes it more difficult for me. I mean, we managed to smell a lot of trinkets that we don't have. Smelting a lot of trinkets we don't have. We're losing a lot of our special hearts as well. But yeah, I do like some of the some of the Curses, the Curses edition. I think this one's pretty interesting. Curses carrion, making all poops red poops. But, at the same time, when you do that, like, one one of the things that I always see with, with, like, modding stuff like this is, yeah, on on paper, it sounds like a pretty interesting idea, but someone out there, some modder, has probably designed a room full of regular poops that is completely unassuming because it's regular poops. But 
if you make them into red poops, it completely changes how the room plays, and it can, it can lead to some instant damage in some cases. Um, and obviously, you don't want that. But, like, there's nothing they can do about it, because this curse just changes them into red poops, and I feel like that's sometimes stuff that isn't really thought about. So, that, that, they're the sort of curses that I like disabling. Oh, hello. Um, I was unable to shoot this, this fella. There you go, I can now. Pretty good. Okay. Keep it going. Keep it running. Also, also, gotta be said that since the streak ended, we have been getting mighty unlucky. Mighty unlucky with our runs. Like, no health drops, bad items, too many actives that we're seeing right now. It's just, ugh. Who the hell wants Delirious? It's, it's just gross. Too many active items, my guy. Too many active items. I'm not really getting to use my uh, my active all that much anyways, so I could have taken it, but... it's a bad hit. Ooh, did I take... Did I lose a full burn heart and heart there? Okay. As I said, this run's probably also doomed to fail as well, to be honest. Um, I'm trying my best, but considering... The fact that we've got this this curse skull thing, whatever you want to call it, from uh, I think that's from Spelunky, isn't it? The idol, the golden idol thing is from Spelunky. So like, yeah, because we got that, probably not going to get too far with this one. But I, I, at the minute, I'm basically for, it, it, with the streak series, so to say, in quotations right now. I'm just kind of testing out the characters and finding my way. Because there's some of these characters that I haven't played as in a long time. And I need to see what's viable for the streak. Like, we're learning that a few characters aren't viable. Elijah isn't really viable for a streak because of some, some of the glitches that we came across. It seems like Naboo um, isn't really viable because of the crashes we came across. It's good to know these things before we start actually getting into the thick of it. I mean, this character's pretty much standard. Like, pretty average character. We don't have to really worry. Um... And yeah, we'll just kind of see what's what. We'll just kind of see what's what. Cyst is very good. Um, yeah, it seems useful for us. Seems useful. Good, good, good. I kind of like this. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, okay. Can we... What? What's left in this room? Oh, it's you. Okay, I see. Okay, we put ourselves in a bad position here. We've got Cootie on lockdown. Trying to help us out best it can. I would like some of the health back that I've left lying around, please. Is there also health in here, maybe? That there is. King of Clubs. Unprime Gigabomb. I guess we'll have a Gigabomb. Why not? Why not? This is an XL floor as well here. Pretty much given up on uh, the idea of Devil Deals and Angel Deals, because Tithe, or whatever it's called, will hopefully help us out. And in here, we've got... What's the point? <laughs> Why do I fucking... Oh, really? And then I can't even get to that chest. Why do I play this goddamn game sometimes? <laughs> what is the point? Just active item after active item after active item. It's just silly. Just room over? Yeah, by the looks of it. Does collecting coins to do damage malarkey seems useful. I like it. Okay. Oh my god. I didn't realise there was another button. I thought it was just the one in the middle. Fiddlesticks. My god, if, if only that nickel spawned during the room rather than after. Then we could get a bunch of damage 
Oh, I've died. Oh, I've revived. Um, I'm guessing that's a feature of this character that I didn't know about. So that's kind of good. We're, uh, we're back on track, baby. <laughs> Ish. Is that it? That is not it, apparently. Yeah, still a bit worried here. Still a bit worried, but we'll keep it going. At least we're still alive, somewhat. There's a heart there. We've not seen our other, uh, other item room as of yet. Would be good to find that. Would be very good to find that. We're not getting as many nickels as we were previously. I was hoping that would be carrying us through. Good old Rotten Heart. I think Rotten Hearts replace Soul Hearts in this character. Which I don't mind. Rotten Hearts are good. Come on, item room. Where art thou? There you go. We got him. We got him. Okay. Missed out on a nickel here because it faded away. I'll take an unidentified pill. Range down isn't that bad. Okay. Boss time. Do another tinted rock. Yeah, definitely Rotten Hearts replacing those. It's kind of nice. This has been a roller coaster of emotions, this run. It really has. It's been a, a wild, wild ride. Can I can I hit you with this? Yes, I can. Just about. You have to stay in the middle, though. Don't go anywhere else. Broken Murdom's keeping him kind of locked down, which is nice. A lot of spiders, my guy. Lovely bit of extra damage. Can't remember what Blue Mum does. Is Blue Mum just more spawns? Don't get Blue Mum very often. Don't get Blue Mum very often at all. Ow. Yeah, we, we lose our full burn heart when we get hit, which is real bad. <laughs> yeah, maybe we can, like, Lazarus it and die once per floor or something. Or maybe it's just the one extra life. Do you know what would be really good if I stopped getting hit? Oh, lord. It's not been a good couple of episodes, people. I do apologize. It's not been the greatest, but either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.